I'm Anastasia, and this is something that helped me. I know every story is different, but I hope that in this you can find something to help you as well. Best of luck. Do you enjoy drawing or coloring? Focusing on creating art can really help to reduce stress. The stressful situation will not magically disappear because you start to draw a picture, but your body's reaction to the stress can be lessened after some nice calming art time. Focused attention on artistic activities takes so much creative concentration that it's a great way to distract your brain from distressing thoughts. When Ben was first diagnosed, I got a few adult coloring books because I wanted to be able to find the perfect page with the perfect inspirational quote to color while he was waiting in hospital settings. And it really is amazing how long some of those adult coloring pages take to complete, but it's an excellent distraction from those appointments that feel eternal. Also, it's great that you can color for a short time and then put it down when your attention is needed elsewhere and pick it right back up later, pick right up where you left off and nothing has lost, nothing has, gotten messed up, nothing got dried out or cracked or ruined. It doesn't even matter how much time has passed. You could put it down and come back to it a year later and start coloring right where you left off and it would be perfectly fine. I love this. <laughs> so um, how about you? Write it out in your journal. Do you love being artistic? What is your favorite way to create? What activity can get you so immersed in it that you lose all track of time as your entire focus is drawn into the art that you're creating. Can you do that today? If not, when can you schedule time into your appointment for that fun creative activity? I hope you'll find time to schedule it in to do that thing that helps you get so immersed into the art that for a moment, you're living entirely in the present, experiencing the moment that you're living as you're living it, not caught up in worry about the future or fear for the future or regret from the past or any of that, just enjoying the art. I hope you can find that moment or create that moment today or this week or sometime soon. It used to really bother me. Every single person would say, I don't know how you do it. And for me, I realized the answer is one day at a time, sometimes one minute at a time. People would say, I could never do that. Yes, yes, you could, and you will. The journey is long and bumpy, but keep taking those tiny steps, and you can do this. I promise. Whatever is standing in front of you today, you can get through it.